Hi everyone, welcome back to Darren Sensory and doing another cast video for today. I'm just doing like types of formal looks, I guess. Um, I don't really know why, I just kind of was like, let's just do different styles of, like dresses, I guess. Um, so first up I did cocktail. Um, I don't really know why I chose cocktail, I just thought it was a nice, I didn't want to do like a, like the tight clock cocktail dress I wanted to do something a bit different so I um basically did like because like normally cocktails are a bit more tight and shorter but I actually decided to um not do that I guess and do um more of a like looser fit because when I was like looking at cocktails I actually saw some more like looser cocktail dresses and I was like you know what I'm gonna go for that instead um because why not go for like a loser cocktail dress um and I went for like a beige colour I thought it was quite cocktail it's a colour of a cocktail so you know that's why I went for that kind of colour um and then pretty normal makeup um a lot of these makeup I just like a more of a nudie kind of look um because yeah so I went for more of like a classy cocktail dress I guess for my first look um so next up was business casual um so this isn't like super dressy and it is but it kind of goes with it so like business casual i decided to go for like a white and pink like suit kind of look it was like styled up so it wasn't so it still gave you the business but like you could wear this out kind of thing as well it wasn't just for the office um, I didn't want to pair it with white pumps because it was a bit basic so I just went for like some white wedges instead um, well not, sorry, not uh, pink wedges, sorry instead um, just to make the look a bit more exciting here um, and then yeah, just kind of gave it the pink everything else I guess um, and then I didn't want to give it too, too businessy here but like still cape but like so it was like a mixture of businessy and formal so I went for this type of here um, and then yeah just basic jewelry I guess um that's that look done I also gave it some, some glasses because I thought it would elevate the look as well to give it more businessy I guess um yeah but that's the first look done a second look done sorry Gosh. I'm not even thinking straight right now um so next up I believe was what did I do next <laughs> um I think it was like dressy casual maybe you dress ca just dressy casual yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna call I'm gonna call it that so I didn't want to go for like super like dress I guess like it was still a dress but I ended up deciding to go for this crop top skirt look instead because I thought a full on dress would be a bit too much maybe so I thought let's try this and go for like a skirt top type look and then elevate it with accessories to make it more dressy if that makes sense so again with like the sparkly shoes and then the pretty long hair and then I gave her a hat as well don't know why I went for the hat I just think it made it a bit more casual um, but then still elevated that look a bit so that's where I went for the hat um, and then paired it with some long hair as well um, the hat doesn't fully match but I couldn't find a hat that like fully matched that colour so I um, went for that brown colour shade even though it didn't fully go with the look but it's fine so that is that look done so next up was I think this was black tie I did next um, so black tie was quite, quite basic um, it's a black dress like what do you expect um, so I kind of went for like a very plain but pretty black dress um, and then elevated it a bit more with the accessories um, but still keeping it in the black tie style I guess um, so you know but made sure everything else was also black because um, I'm a, I'm, 
I, I just kind of was like, it's black to my eyes, to be black, um, fully black. Uh, but I didn't want it to feel too goth, so I tried to make it still pretty, I guess. Um, I was thinking about adding some like, nice gloves, but I wanted short gloves that were like sheer, but we don't have those. So I ended up touching the gloves part of the look and just going for like basic plain hands again, I guess. Um, and then again, keeping it very dark makeup, um, but giving it a slightly red lip because I thought it would like elevate the look a bit if you had a bit of colour with the lip, but not too bright because it is very. I still wanted it to be quite dark, and her hair is quite bright anyway. So yeah. <laughs> so my final look, I think, that's my final look. Um, is I wanted to just do classic formal like that's a like classic formal pretty um so I go for just a plain burgundy dress and elevate it with the accessories again um just make it look like really stylish as possible um and then you can't really see the shoes if I gave you red pumps anyway but that's about it really so let me know what your favourite look was um which style you would go for for your elevated formal looks I guess um yeah I don't really know um but that's it so I think I'm gonna wrap it up here thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again soon with the video bye